Welcome to Technical Drawing. Today we'll see how to draw front view, sectional top view, TSS and development of a lateral surface of part P. This is front view, top view. Now first we will divide this circle into 12 parts because the diameter is 60. Now we'll divide this into 12 parts and we'll project all this line. See there are no edges. So we need to divide this into 8 or 12 parts. We have divided into 12 parts because diameter is more than 50. Now after that, we will name A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, J. I'll just extend all these lines up. This is A dash B and M, B dash M dash C dash L dash D dash K dash E dash J dash F dash H dash and G dash. Now if you see this point is getting cut, see this, the cutting plane line is like this. So this is point PA, this is PA dash. This is point PB and PM, PA dash, oh sorry, PB dash and PM dash. This is PC and PL. This point is PD and PK dash see this pd and pk now this point whenever you cut top surface you get two point that will write as pu dash pv dash that i'll project down straight from here so i'll get this sectional top view now i'll hatch this part This is PU, this is PV. Now we need to draw TSS. So to draw TSS, what I will do? First, I will draw the cutting plane line horizontal. So I will draw one horizontal line and I will mark that distance from PA dash to PU dash PV dash. So this is PU dash PV dash and this is PA dash. Now what I will do, I will take this distance, I will cut here and I will mark all this point. So I can take from PA dash to PD dash, PK dash and I will cut from PA, see this, PA dash. So that way you can mark all this point respectively. This is PB dash, PM dash. So we, we so we got all these points. We'll project one by one. See, I'm extending PU PV. So this is PV. This is PU. Then we'll extend from point from PA dash, and from here A. We will get point PA. Now we will project B and M. See by one by one you can project all these points. If you have done naming then it would be very easy to plot all these points. Same way C and L. PC dash, PL dash. And then D and K.
Now join all these points with free hand. And you can do hatching. So this is true sectional shape, TSS. Now after this, we'll draw development. All of you know development of this lateral part. It will be 2 pi r. So c equals to 2 into 22 by 7 into radius. Uh, if you want me to write formula, I can write formula. C is equal to 2 into pi into r. So when you solve this, you get answer as 188.4 will take round off to 189. So I'll take 189 and I will draw rectangle. Height will be equal to this much. Now we have to divide this into how many parts? 12 parts. Why 12 parts? Because we have divided circle into 12 parts. Now join 12 to this last point and draw parallel line. So you will divide this development into 12 part. Length C is equal to 189. We will divide 189 into 12 parts. Now draw vertical line. So this is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, J. I'm not writing I, K, L, M, and A. Now what we need to do, we need to project all these points. P A dash. You extend from here, wherever it will cut on A, that is point P A. Then B and M. So this is point M. This is point B. P B P M. This is P C. This is PL. This is PD. And this is PK. Now we have PU, PV. So you can't mark from front view. So we'll take it from top view. We'll take D to PU. We'll cut here. Then we'll take K to PV. And we cut between K and J. So this is how you'll get all these points. Then we join all these points with free hand. So then you'll get the development. Join all these points with free hand. So you'll get development. Uh, so I hope you people have understood this. This is an ICSC technical drawing 2023 exam board paper question. Thank you.